guys, it's Rachel and today I have a very exciting video. I am so excited to finally be doing this. I don't know why I haven't filmed this video yet, but it's a what's in my swim bag and I'm a competitive swimmer and I also do varsity swim for my school, which I'm currently doing right now until mid-November. My main stroke is breaststroke and before you see what's in my swim bag, make sure that you press subscribe so you can see more swim videos, beauty videos, and fashion videos. So yeah, I'm just going to get into what's in my bag. So I got this bag about three or four years ago, and, and it's just the old Speedo bag. I'm not sure what color or what the exact model is, but I haven't gotten around to getting the new version. So I haven't cleaned out anything, and this is just what's in it all the time. I'm going to start with this side pocket. So it does have a bottle holder. Inside, I just have a garbage bag, I guess, if I don't want clothes to get wet. Then in the pocket above that, on this pocket, I have an empty hand sanitizer and this little, like, cupcake keychain just so that I can identify my bag. So in here, I usually have my phone, but it's right over there. I also have my membership card to the pool I practice at for Club Swim. I have some earplugs, which I never use. But if I have swimmers here and if I'm kicking, I'll use these. I then have a temporary tattoo, which was from a benefit meet. I have one of these strings for a bag tag, and I don't have any bag tags on my bag right now, which is kind of a long story. I have some hair ties. I have a lock, which I use for swim meets. And I have a quarter. So now if you rotate the bag right here, I just have this little doll, and I'm not sure what they're called, but I just thought it was cute. And then in the pocket that says Speedo, I have a dollar bill, which is extremely crumpled up. I have some pencils and pens for meets, or if I have to do my homework, if I'm getting to practice early. Then in the wet bag, I keep my good goggles that I use every practice, and the rainbow. I don't use bungees anymore because they were giving me a really bad headache. I don't know why. I also have a bunch of caps that are like the same exact ones. I also have a backup pair of those same exact rainbow goggles. And I have these random goggles that I just found out I have. Now I'm going to go into the big pit, which is the main part of this bag. So like I said, I have everything that's always in here. I didn't rearrange anything. The first thing I have is my snorkel. I use a TYR snorkel. I use my snorkel only for high school practice, but for club practice, I have a mesh bag which has flippers and paddles. I also have a backup suit, which is TYR, and I really like this suit because it looks super good on you in the summer when you're tan, and it's just royal blue with green straps. I have this towel, which is from Urban Outfitters, and it's like a bandana print, and I think it's so cute. I also have this mandatory parent meeting sheet, which I never told my mom to go to. I have this swapped tangler. I have my sneakers in case we're doing dry land, and inside of my sneakers I have these American flag socks, which need to get washed. Then there's my chamois, which I never use because I don't really like it too much, but sometimes I use it. Then I have a granola bar. Not sure when this is from. That's gross. I have half pack of eating gummies. I have a good granola bar. I have a Lululemon headband that I've been looking for for ages. So if you know about this bag, then you know that there's a compartment inside of it, which is really handy, and people usually use it for their soup, but I use it for, like, shower products. So I usually don't shower at the place of practice, but I have stuff in case I do. So I have this Tresemme conditioner. I have this Suave Shea Butter shampoo, a hairbrush, some face wash, some body wash, which is just a Christmas brand from Bath & Body Works. <gasps> Ew! No. I have this hairy, hard as a rock, rotten Z-bar. <laughs> and 
out. And here's the wrapper for it. And I also have this tennis ball, which is really hairy. And sometimes if I have time at meets, I'll just use it to like roll out, but I usually don't. So the last part of my swim bag is the other bottle holder since they're on both sides. So I have a water bottle, which is from practice earlier today. So don't worry, I'm not having a gross old water bottle. And then in the pocket, there's, oh, yeah, there we go. Rotten gummies. I apologize for all this garbage I have in my bag. Like I said, I don't clean out my bag, and I have a whole pile of food that's rotten right in front of me. So, thank you guys for watching all the disturbing things I have in my swim bag. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video, which will probably be on Tuesday. Bye.